Hey guys, it's Gary here. Uh, long time no video. Uh, no excuses, just been uh, really busy. Um, and I can't, you know what, I can't believe four weeks have gone by and I really have made a video. But anyway, here I am. Uh, so this is a uh, recap in uh, week 13, 14, 15, and 16. Week 13, uh, I lost one pound. Week 14, I lost 5 pounds. Week 15, I lost 3 pounds. And week 16, I lost 5 pounds. So a total of 14 more pounds lost. It makes my uh, my total weight from the beginning of my sur the beginning of my journey with my pre-op weight. Uh, a total of 114 pounds gone. Gone forever. Bye-bye. Um, my weight is, uh, I'm not sure if it's quite slowing down yet, I mean, but it's coming off more sporadically. I was averaging five pounds a week, but obviously I have a one pound and a three pound week in there. So, uh, it's just, uh, it's coming off more sporadically. Uh, maybe it's slowing down, I don't know, time will tell. I'm sure it has to slow down sooner or later, but I, obviously I can't complain, because so I've lost uh, 114 pounds very quickly. Um, see uh, I, uh, I started off wearing uh, 4x shirts and size 46 pants now I'm into size 2x shirt and they fit pretty well very getting getting actually getting loose on me and also size 38 pants which fit great uh, haven't been 38 in a long time Anyway, uh, move along. Exercise. I gotta tell you, I really haven't been exercising. Besides, I do some hiking here and there. I do a lot of hiking. Besides hiking, I you know I bought a uh, treadmill that I mentioned before in my other videos, and I started using it and I stopped. So I need to get back my butt back on the treadmill and really start getting used to it. You know, sometimes I'm very busy and a lot of times with the kids and everything, they don't go to sleep until eight and by the time that comes around some T V shows come on and then, you know, blah blah blah, then I don't get on it. Or I get on it at one o'clock in the morning, which is which is really ridiculous. I should be getting to bed a lot sooner than that. Um anyway, uh I know pooping is uh problem for everyone and we've all talked about poop and people are worried about talking about poop. I'm not offended by poop. I like to talk about poop. My poop is doing good right now. Uh, I have been using Benefiber and uh, I use a three year four scoops a day. I mix it with my protein shake in the morning and that's been keeping me pretty good. Uh, yeah, another topic is uh, farting. Um, the fart word, F word. Ooh. Uh, Farting, geez, I've never farted so much in my life. I fart constantly, and it's uh, obviously my wife is not like it, but I make a joke. <coughs> I really make a joke that I fart so much. I think I lose a pound every time I fart. It's amazing, uh, and very, uh, very potent. So I'm sure everyone has the same problem, but people just don't talk about farting because it's not proper to talk about farting fart farting it's funny too everyone thinks it's funny why are farts funny I don't know I love them I'm not loving the smell but uh, if anyone knows any tips on making the odor go away besides I think I've seen some bean beano or something some kind of uh, herb or something that's supposed to Make you fart less? I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Farting's farting. Get over it. A uh, couple things I want to show you. I had tried a new uh, protein, powdered protein. Do, 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 do. This is gold standard whey. Uh, this is cookies and cream. Cooking the cream and I really like it. It's very, very good. Uh, it's something new I tried. I thought I'd try something. 
different, but uh, very good. 24 grams protein. Uh, makes it with milk. You get about another 9 grams. Uh, so it's really good. I recommend it. Uh, another thing I tried is uh, Special K's Protein Plus. Um, 10 grams of protein, 9 grams net carbs, and 5 grams of fiber. There's more fiber. I like it. it. I like it. It's good. But not as good as what I showed you before, the uh, Kashi Goline. La, la, la. Kashi Goline Crunch. This is my favorite all times. Uh, it just tastes great. It's crunchy. It's great with milk. And uh, a lot of times I have it for a snack. <clears throat> like when I come home from work, I usually have a snack. Uh, I have a uh, light and fit yogurt, 60 calories. And I usually pour some of this in there. I'll have a few, a few handfuls of this just for a snack. And it's really good. And you can put it in a bag, take it with you. I mean, it's an awesome snack. I recommend it. Um, let's see. Uh, I've made a... Uh, I found a... Uh, I mean, I'm sure some people know about it. I'm, a lot of people know about it. Bariatriceating.com. Uh, if you go to the website, I'll put it in the sidebar. But if you go to the website, <coughs> click on Health and Nutrition. Uh, under there, it is Recipes. And uh, I've been trying a bunch of their recipes. I have tried so far uh, chicken and black beans, which is excellent. I cannot tell you how good it is. It is very simple to make and it is awesome. Very good. Excellent. I mean, it's just black beans and chicken and a whole bunch of other stuff. It's got some cumin in it, so it's got a little bit of a southwestern flair or Mexican taste to it, whatever you want to say. Uh, excellent. You put some cheddar cheese on top of it and a scoop of uh, sour cream. It's awesome. Uh, also, I've tried chicken cordon bleu. <clears throat> Nothing special there. I mean, basically, chicken, pound it out with a hammer and... Uh, well, a meat, meat hammer. Pound it out, flatten it out, put on uh, some Dijon mustard uh, and a slice of ham and a slice of Swiss cheese. Roll it up nice and tight and bake it. And put some uh, some breadcrumbs on top, some plant, plano breadcrumbs. I don't know. That's very good, too. I like it. And uh, for, uh, for Thanksgiving, I made a off the website, the no sugar added cherry cheesecake. And let me tell you something. I'm a big cheesecake fan, and that was good. I loved it. I ate the whole pie. Not in one night. It lasted me a week. I had a slice, I had a slice a night for dessert. And uh, it was very good. Definitely try it. Uh, and tonight, I made turkey quinoa and turkey and quinoa chili and another recipe is a little little more advanced for some people it's a lot a lot of ingredients but uh, it was excellent I you know very good uh, I had another chili recipe out there and it's another it's a really easy one uh, just right chili from the uh, uh, weight loss for uh, dummies book and that's a really easy, easy, easy one. And uh, but this one's got a little more complexity to it, so it's got a lot more uh, spices and stuff. So really good. I definitely suggest it. Um, anyway, uh, besides that, that's all I have on my list. Um, like I said, I've been busy, had a cold, and. Uh, haven't been making videos but just because I've been too lazy or I've been doing too many things and haven't gotten around to it. I've been saying I'm going to get around to it, around, around to it. Whatever. It is what it is. I'm here. I'm back. I'll make it in my next video on Wednesday. Uh, is it, I go from Wednesday to Wednesdays. Anybody, uh, I want to thank you. Uh, I have got some new subscribers. I'm up to like 95 subscribers now. I want to thank all my new subscribers. If I haven't gotten to your channel and given you dropped a little note, uh, 